Dream Chasing Boxing here. All right, I'm back with a quick post fight. Adrian Broner versus Ashley Theo Payne. For those that heard my pre-fight kind of, but not even in the pre-fight, I just spoke about Broner missing weight. I didn't care about this fight. But um, I basically said throw $20 on Ashley Theo Payne because, I mean, Broner has so much going on, and he's not a mentally tough fighter. He has heart, but he's not mentally tough, and it showed tonight. I mean, he was tired after the third round, man. He was tired, wasn't throwing punches. I don't know what, what, what the punch stats were. I didn't even bother looking at him, but uh, he was throwing, what, like 10, 15 punches a round? But um, to get into the fight, man, basically, Broner was landing the hardest shots. Ashley Theofane was busier. And, you know, as one would, would expect, Ashley Theofane uh, started to apply pressure. He couldn't push Broner back. Broner was just, he was just a bigger fighter, and Ashley Theofane didn't have the kind of power to make Adrian Broner respect him. But Broner was so out of fucking shape, dog. He was so out of shape that even so, Ashley Theofane would basically, he started to win rounds just off being busy. And had this fight not gotten stopped prematurely like a motherfucker, I mean, who knows what would have happened because, all right, basically in round nine, I believe, um, um, Broner scores a TKO victory over Ashley Theofane. Referee break, breaks it up after, you know, Broner has him hurt and Theofane is wobbling around the ring. But he's okay. He knows where he's at. And Broner really has a lot of trouble cutting off the ring. And Ashley Theofane was basically half of, you know, half of the di distance of the ring away. And then the referee just jumps in and stops it. So that was an extremely strange, weird, and unnecessary stoppage because had that not happened, Ashley Theofane landed his fair shots in the fight, was landing body shots all night. And look, man, Ashley Theofane could have still won this fight. He could have still won this fight just based off the fact that Broner was just so out of fucking shape, man. He was just tired and he just wasn't there, man. He wasn't focused. I mean, all, all that shit, man. Everything that we thought we, we were going to see, we saw from Adrian Broner in terms of him looking like shit. If this was a Adrian Broner that came prepared and ready and actually trained and made weight, for example, dog, this would have been such an easy fight for him. This would have been an easy fucking fight for Adrian Broner that came shit. Like, he, he's so much better than Ashley Theofane that even like a fucking clearly, clearly out of shape Broner still gave him this much um, problems. But... I mean, that's all I have to say on this fight, man. I mean, I, technically, I don't even really want to get into it. It was actually Theofane is not that good of a fighter. Brona was out of shape. So there's nothing to really technically break down. It's just that Brona still struggles with the same thing because he doesn't take the time out to improve because he comes to camp trying to make weight. So he's never really improving his skill set. He's always just trying to make weight. So I, like I said, I jumped off the shift on Broner. Questionable stoppage. And I'm out, man.